Who are the people in your neighborhood? They're the people that you meet when you're on a quarantine. They're the people that you meet each day. Hi, guys, and welcome to Who Are the People in Your Neighborhood? This is a new series that we're starting here at The Help Habit to feature people in our community and the things that they do best. So today I have brought on my most favorite person in the community. This is my husband, Willie Beavers, and he has brought his mustache here today. Hi, Willie. Hello. Thanks for being here. You're welcome. Okay, so I um, have asked Willie, and I'll be asking everyone in these interviews, the coronavirus has changed the way that we do business in a lot of ways. And for many of us in the community, it has required us to scale back on business and or even close our doors. So Willie, what have you noticed? How has your business been impacted by coronavirus or has it been at all? Um, it's been impacted a little bit, just I need to be more cautious. I have a uh, um, immune system. So, you know, um, if I don't have to go in the customer's house, I don't um, try and keep a distance away from the customer. Um, and, um, handling money a lot, maybe have them put it in an envelope or something. Um, try not to shake hands, even though it can be a, a habit just to do it. Um, but a lot of people are home right now using their plumbing, so um, still staying pretty busy. You know, everybody's home using everything so there's still plumbing problems and um and most of the research that people read it's still okay to call your plumber electrician or local contractors to uh do whatever work needs to be done at your house so i'm still working um but at the same time trying to be cautious um and just keeping a distance away from people okay super that makes my heart happy as well, because as Willie mentioned, he um, he does have leukemia and he's getting cancer treatments right now. So he's one of the people um, that I think of most when we try to flatten the curve and stay home to not spread illness. So I like how you said that you are, uh, you're not being rude, you're just not shaking hands or uh, giving a hug after you unclog someone's toilet. <laughs> yeah, and it's hard. Every once in a while I slip and shake somebody's hand or somebody will give me a hug and you know, for saving the day, but, um, you know, it's tricky. You just have to be aware and, um, you know, everybody just needs to try and follow these rules so we can be done sooner with it than later. Agreed. Okay. Now, um, I've asked you to share a tip with the community. What is something that the community may not know that might be helpful for them in regards to plumbing during this time? What do you want to share? Um, well, you know, a lot of people are, you know, the TP and the baby wipes, you know, obviously it's okay to flush the TP down, but the baby wipes, as people are saying, keep the wipes out of the pipes. Um, or I'm going to be at your house, snake in your line, pulling wipes out, which I already have been to a few houses. So, you know, put a trash can next to your toilet and just throw them away. Might seem disgusting, but um, it's going to be cheaper in the long run, so um, be the best thing. And, you know, like everybody else is saying, just try and wash your hands as much as you can each day. Great. Okay, so Willie, how can people get a hold of you if they have indeed flushed a wipe in the pipe and they're having a problem with their plumbing? So I'm on the internet. You can Google, you know, name of my company, Willows Plumbing. Makes it easy. Uh, plumber, Willows. Um, anything like that. I should be one of the first ones to come up on Google. Um, I have a Facebook page, which sometimes can be delayed. Um, it seems like sometimes my business page doesn't get my alerts to me quicker than I'd want to, but that's another way. Or you can just direct message me on Facebook or instant messenger. Then um, of course, all the guys down at the hardware store have my number. Um, and you know my number is on my side of my truck um 517 
So um, those are all ways you can get a hold of me. Okay. Thank you so much. So there you have it. Keep the wipes out of the pipes and no hugging your plumber after he fixes your line. Thanks, Willie. You're welcome. Okay. Bye. Bye-bye.